The United States Supreme Court's 2023 to 2024 term is set to commence on October 2nd, heralding a pivotal year for American jurisprudence. The Sistine Judicial Body, often referred to as SCOTUS, stands as the apex of the nation's judiciary and spearheads the federal government's judicial branch. The Heritage Foundation hosted an event that included expert speakers who delved into the anticipated highlights of this forthcoming term. They invited Honorable Paul Clement, who is the 43rd Solicitor General of the United States, and Lisa Blatt, who is a partner and chair of the Supreme Court and Appellate Practice. But if you sort of think about kind of the history of the modern Second Amendment, the Supreme Court in Heller says it's an individual right, doesn't say privilege, very clearly says it's an individual right. And then in McDonald against the city of Chicago, it says that this right is a fundamental right, it's not a second class right, and therefore it is incorporated against the state governments. And so presumptively, every state and local gun law is subject to constitutional scrutiny. Honorable Clement offered a valuable perspective on the interpretation and significance of the Second Amendment. He underscores the historical evolution of the Second Amendment as understood by the Supreme Court, from recognizing it as an individual right in the landmark case of Heller to elevating it to the status of a fundamental right in McDonald v. City of Chicago. In addition to its examination of the Second Amendment, SCOTUS will turn its attention to scrutinizing the double jeopardy clause within the Fifth Amendment. Navigating the intricate landscape of immigration and confronting issues pertaining to racial gerrymandering. As a result of the Chevron Doctrine, it's an available option for the new administration that comes in to change the interpretation of a lot of these statutes, sometimes on very important issues. Um, when you get an executive order that does that, it typically gets challenged, um, often seeking a nationwide injunction against the new rule, comes up to the Supreme Court. The United States Supreme Court embarks on its 2023 to 2024 term, the legal world watches with keen interest. With a docket encompassing vital issues and a dynamic legal landscape, this term promises to shape the course of American jurisprudence. The insights shared by legal experts, such as the Honorable Paul Clement, highlight the evolving nature of statutory interpretation and the pivotal role of the court in defining the United States legal framework.